If you are a Kansan with a disability, you have certain rights that protect your ability to vote. This video contains information on your voting rights, as well as what it takes to register and vote. You may ask yourself, why should I register and vote? You may think that as a person with a disability, your vote isn't important. Your vote is important. Your vote is powerful. In fact, it's one key to unlock the door to justice for people with disabilities. It's a sad fact, but in past presidential elections, nearly 30 million Americans with disabilities did not vote. Imagine the political earthquake that would be created if those 30 million people with disabilities voted. We would be able to dramatically enhance the rights of people with disabilities, eliminate waiting lists for critical services, and expand the capacity of community-based services. What are some of your rights to vote as a Kansan with a disability? You have a right to vote in Kansas regardless of your disability. Kansas law requires that you must be registered to vote in the place you live. You can vote if you are a United States citizen who is at least 18 years of age on election day, live in the state of Kansas, and have registered to vote at least 15 days before the election. As a voter with a disability, you have the right to vote in an accessible polling place. That means that you can get from your vehicle through the door to cast your ballot without physical barriers or impediments. Or you can choose to exercise your right to curbside voting. However, whether you curbside vote is your choice. No poll worker can make you vote curbside. You also have the right to vote at home by advance ballot. Inspect a sample ballot, request a demonstration of the voting procedure, receive assistance if you need assistance to vote, obtain a replacement ballot if you make a mistake, vote if you are in line when the polls close, vote without disclosing that vote to anyone, and to vote for or against candidates or propositions as you choose. Here are answers to some frequently asked questions. What do I have to do to register to vote? Complete the Kansas voter registration application by answering all the questions and mail or take it to your local election office. You can get the application from your local election office, government offices, or from www.kssos.org. The application must be delivered or postmarked at least 15 days before the election in which you intend to vote. What if I want to vote at home? Not a lot of people know you have the right to vote in the privacy of your own home. It's called advance voting and you can get an application for advance voting at your election office or www.kssos.org. If you have a permanent disability, you may apply for a permanent advance ballot. Applying for a permanent advance ballot allows you to vote at home for every election. If your polling is not accessible, contact DRC. I have a guardian. May I still vote? Generally, yes. You can vote even if you have a guardian or conservator appointed over you or if you have been subject to an order of involuntary civil commitment. With guardianship only, if the judge in your guardianship case has entered an order that you do not have the capacity to vote, that order should be challenged with that judge. Contact DRC for advice on this topic. I am a first-time voter. Do I need any special documentation? Yes. If you are a first-time voter in your county, you must show an identification such as a driver's license, non-driver's ID card, a bank statement, your paycheck stub, or a bill such as utility bill or cable bill that has your current address. If you are a first-time voter, you can provide this information at the time of registration, before election day, at the polls on election day, at the time you apply or vote your advance ballot, or after election day, but before the county canvass. How? Can DRC help me with voting? Under the Federal Protection and Advocacy for Voting Access Law, DRC is authorized to help people with disabilities register to vote, cast a ballot, 
apply for advance voting, ensure accessibility of your polling place, and other services to ensure the full participation of people with disabilities in the electoral process. If you are a person with a disability, or a parent or guardian of a child with a disability, and you have questions about the right to vote or other disability rights issues, you can call Disability Rights Center of Kansas. DRC has special authority and is empowered by federal law to provide legally based disability rights advocacy, public policy advocacy, public education, outreach, and training.